dropped it. And the Rebels are going to win it. Make it two years in a row. 43-37. 11th ranked Ole Miss knocks off number two, Alabama, and climbs to the top of the SEC West. What a game here in Tuscaloosa. With Ole Miss football being ranked number three in the country in the national AP poll, and with a top defense, nearly everyone is talking about the land shark. Now considered the Rebels' defense signature way of making plays, it has also become a method of celebration on and off the field. One student even started a petition to see just how much support the land shark had and says he was quite surprised at the immense response. Very surprised at the amount of people that got behind the land shark uh, petition just as out of support. And uh, I started yesterday afternoon just get, trying to get a couple hundred people to support it. And it turns out it really took off and uh, really shows that a lot of people care about the land shark around this university, in the stands, and everywhere. I think it's a good idea to change the mascot to the land sharks because no one really knows about the black bear. Everyone gets kind of pumped up with the land shark and the hand sign and stuff. However, the land shark can be found in many different places besides just here on the football field. Professors and students alike have shared the unofficial Ole Miss symbol with people across the world, and the football team haven't been the only Rebels celebrating with their fins up. There's a pitch, swung on, ground ball toward Robinson. He comes hard, gloves it, fires to first. In time for the out! And he throws up the land shark. <laughs> Where it translates over to baseball, it's... Um, you know, just it's different because it's not, you know, blood in the water like football, but it's also another way to, you know, express your, your feelings. And really when I did that, it's just, you know, the emotions going through me and uh, being, you know, the, the most excited you can be in the biggest stage. While the black bear doesn't seem to be going anywhere soon, the land shark has certainly made a splash on Rebel Nation. Newswatch, Kelly Savage.